Hey, I'm Rami Malek, and I'm hosting SNL with musical guest Young Thug. That's me. No, you're Bowen. Wait, Bowen is a musical guest? No, I, Ego. I get to meet Bowen Yang, the greatest rapper of all time. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's so nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Rami Malek, and I'm hosting SNL with musical guest Young Thug. You know, Rami, a lot of people find your eyes unnerving, but I don't see it. Thank you. You two should have a staring contest. I'm down. This man is a demon. Hi, I'm Rami Malek, and I'm hosting SNL with musical guest Young Thug. Rami, we love the new Bond movie. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that was dope. No, so good. I mean, when Grisabella goes back to the Jellicle Ball and sings that song, oh my God, little uh, tears. No, I'm pretty sure you're thinking of the movie Cats. I'm pretty sure we're thinking of the new Bond movie. Well, are there any cats in it? Tons. Yeah, that's cats. Yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, absolutely.
in one. That's a whole lot of money. At least I think it is. I'm confused by the currency. Anyway, I'm on a glass bridge, and I think I'm gonna win. Hey, look, it's my friend Pete. And you go bye bye now. There's a robot girl who caught me running. Better duck behind the nearest guy. Wait, what? Three yelling at me in Korean, and nothing is translated. <laughs> My cookie and I got eliminated. Got a crazy girlfriend, thinks she might stab me. After I was dead, it took my eyeball and my kidney. Hey, hey, you know that? That's what happens in the squid game. People die. Green light. That's the way you play the squid game. Hi British Vogue, I'm Lucy Boynton and this is what's in my bag. Okay, there's a lot. I would probably never travel without a good book, or two apparently. I can't really focus on fiction when I'm filming, which I am at the moment. So I've got The Man Who Mistook His Wife for a Hat, which is a book about neurology and it's so interesting. And then I've got Shirley Jackson, a classic. Glasses, Warby Parker glasses, which I actually keep a note from my sister in and Apparently a cloakroom ticket. Because I travel so much, I like to have little like personal things from family or like memories or something. I'm very sentimental, as you can tell. Lots of script sides. Every day when you go to work, when filming, you get a little miniature script of all the scenes that you're doing that day. iPod, because apparently I'm the last person still using an iPod and a Hotmail account. 